BECE 2017 Objective Test for Integrated Science. Question number one. The instrument used to measure relative humidity is the A. Hydrometer, B. Hygrometer, C. Rain gauge, D. Wind vane. And the answer is B. Hygrometer. The instrument used to measure relative humidity is the hygrometer. Number two, the SI unit for density is A, MS raised to power negative 1, B, MS raised to power negative 2, C, KGM raised to power negative 3, D, M cube KG raised to power negative 1. And the answer is C, KG m raised to power negative three that's the si unit for density number three when light travels from glass to air its speed is a increased b reduced c halved d unchanged the answer is a increased when light travels from glass to air its speed is increased number four when a piece of iron rod is brought near a permanent magnet for a while it becomes magnetized by A. Stroking method B. Electrical method C. Friction D. Induction And the answer is D. Induction When a piece of iron rod is brought near a permanent magnet for a while, it becomes magnetized by induction. Number 5. A rheostat is used in an electric circuit in order to A. Increase electric current only B. Decrease electric current only. C. Keep electric current constant. D. Increase and decrease electric current. And the answer is D. Increase and decrease electric current. A rheostat is used in an electric circuit in order to increase and decrease electric current. Number six. Okay. Number six. Which of the following statement about an opaque object is correct? An opaque object a. Allows light to pass through it partially. B. Allows light to pass through it fully. C. Forms a shadow. D. Does not form a shadow. And the answer is C. Forms a shadow. And then the question was which of the following statements about an opaque object is correct? An opaque object forms a shadow. Number seven. One of the characteristics of a, characteristics of a solid is that A. Its particles are tightly packed. B. It assumes the shape of the container it occupies. C. It has no fixed volume. D. Its particles can easily be separated. And the answer is A. Its particles are tightly packed. One of the characteristics of a solid is that its particles are tightly packed. Number 8. The instrument used to measure current in an electric circuit is the A. Ammeter, B, photometer, C, thermometer, D, voltmeter. And the answer is A, ammeter. The instrument used to measure current in an electric circuit is the ammeter. Number nine, the bottom of a pool of water appears closely to the surface than it is. Which of the following properties accounts for this observation? A, reflection, B, transparency of water, C, refraction, D, rectilinear propagation and the answer is c refraction the bottom of a pool of water appears closer to the surface than it is which of the following properties accounts for this observation and that is refraction number 10 an example of a source of energy which is non-renewable is a petroleum b solar c tide d wind and the answer is a petroleum an example of a source of energy which is non-renewable is petroleum. Number 11. Which of the following apparatus is not required in the process of distillation in the laboratory? A. Condenser. B. Evaporating dish. C. Benson burner. D. Round button flux. And the answer is B. Evaporating dish. Number 12. The number of oxygen atoms present in three molecules of carbon dioxide is A, 3, B, 4, C, 5, D, 6. And the answer is D, 6. Number 13. The chemical formula C12 represents two 
A. Atoms of chlorine B. Neutrons of chlorine C. Ions of chlorine D. Molecules of chlorine And the answer is A. Atoms of chlorine The chemical formula C12 represent 2 A. Atoms of chlorine Number 14. Which of the following substances can rust? A. Aluminium B. Bauxite C. Copper D. Steel And the answer is D. Steel Which of the following substances can rust? And the answer is steel Number 15. Energy stored in food is referred to as A. Chemical energy B. Heat energy C. Solar energy D. Kinetic energy And the answer is A. Chemical energy Energy stored in food is referred to as chemical energy Number 16. Which of the following substances is a mixture? A. Water B. Sodium chloride C. Sodium chloride solution D. Ion filing And the answer is C. Sodium chloride solution which of the following substances is a mixture? And the answer is C, sodium chloride solution. Number 17. The mole is the SI unit of A, amount of substance, B, luminous intensity, C, temperature, D, mass of substance. And the answer is C, temperature. The mole is the SI unit of temperature. Number 18. An atom has a proton number of 17 and neutron number 18 determine the number of electrons in the third shell of the atom a 1 b 3 c 5 d 7 and the answer is d 7 an atom has a proton number of 17 and neutron number 18 determine the number of electrons in the third shell of the atom and the answer is 7. Number 19. An example of mixtures that can be separated by the method of filtration is A. Sugar in water. B. Sand in water. C. Oil in water. D. Ink in water. And the answer is B. Sand in water. An example of mixtures that can be separated by the method of filtration is sand in water. Number 20. Which of the following liquids will turn blue litmus paper red? A. Vinegar B. Water C. Ammonia solution D. Bicarbonate solution And the answer is A. Vinegar Which of the following liquids will turn blue litmus paper red? And the answer is vinegar Number 21. Which of the following particles constitute matter? I. Atoms I. I. Molecules I. 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 Ions and the possible answers are A, I only, B, I, I only, C, I, I and I, I, I only, D, I, I, I and I, I, I. And the answer is D, I, I, I and I, I, I. Which of the following particles constitute matter? And the answer is atoms, molecules and ions. Number 22, an example of inheritable characteristics in humans is A, shape of nose, B, knowledge, C, ability to speak different languages, D, handwriting. And the answer is A, shape of nose. An example of inheritable characteristics in humans is shape of nose. Number 23, which of the following statements about aerobic respiration is correct? A, the byproducts are carbon dioxide and water. B. Little amount of energy is produced. C. Oxygen is not required. D. The byproducts are alcohol and carbon dioxide. And the answer is A. The byproducts are carbon dioxide and water. Which of the following statements about aerobic respiration is correct? The byproducts are carbon dioxide and water. Number, number 24. Spence produced by the testes in humans are temporarily stored in the A. Epididymis B. Postate gland C. Seminal vesicles D. Sperm duct And the answer is A. Epididymis Sperm produced by the testes in humans are temporarily stored in the epididymis Number 25. Which of the following changes normally 
Okay, drawing an old age in humans. A. Gray hair starts appearing. B. Mental alertness increases. C. Broadening of chest. D. Attraction of the opposite sex. And the answer is A. Gray hair starts appearing. Number 26. One of the characteristics of wind pollinator flowers is that they A. Are large and con conspicuous. B. As usu are usually centered. C. Have a nectar. D. Have filthy stigma. And the answer is D. Have filthy stigma. One of the characteristics of wind pollinator flowers is that they have filthy stigma. Number 27. The testes are normally located outside the body of the male because A. The temperature of the body is too high for effective sperm production. B. They cannot increase in size when it is in the body. C. They can absorb moisture from the atmosphere. D. They occupy too much space. And the answer is A. The temperature of the body is too high for effective sperm production. The testes are normally located outside the body of the male because the temperature of the body is too high for effective sperm production. Number 28. The organelle which occupies the largest portion of a plant cell is the A. Chloroplast. B. Mitochondria. C. Nucleus. D. Vacuole. And the answer is D. Vacuole. The organelle which occupies the largest portion of a plant cell is the vacuole. Number 29. Movement of the ribs is brought about by the A. Pleural cavity. B. Intercostal muscle. C. Larynx. D. Trachea. And the answer is B. Intercostal muscle. Number 29. Movement of the ribs is brought about by the intercostal muscle. Number 30. Fertilization in humans usually occurs in the A. Ovary. B. Uterus. C. Vagina. D. Fallopian tube. And the answer is D. Fallopian tube. Fertilization in humans usually occurs in the fallopian tube. Number 31. Which of the following processes is an example of osmosis? A. Spreading of perfume in a room. B. Absorption of food nutrients in the, in the small intestines. C. Spreading of potassium permanganate in water. D. Absorption of water into the root hairs. And the answer is D. Absorption of water into the root hairs. Which of the following processes is an example of osmosis? Absor absorption of water into the root hairs. Number 32. The part of a living cell which is semi-permeable is A. Cytoplasm. B. Nucleus. C. Protoplasm. D. Cell membrane. And the answer is D. Cell membrane. The part of the living cell which is semi-permeable is D cell membrane number 33 which of the following statements about soil profile is or are correct it helps the farmer to determine i soil fertility i i water holding capacity of the soil i i i depth of the soil and the possible answers are a i only b i and i i only c i i and i i i only d i i i and i i i and the answer is D, I, 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 and I, I, I. Number 34. Which of the following practices is not a principle of crop rotation? A. Legumes should be added to the rotation program. B. Deep-rooted crops should be followed by shallow-rooted crops. C. Crops that are closely related should follow each other. D. Fallow period should be allowed during the time of rotation. And the answer is C. Crops that are closely related should follow each other. Which of the following practices is not a principle of crop rotation? And the answer was C. Crops that are closely related should follow each other. 
Number 35, the relative proportion of sand, silt, and clay in a given sample of soil is soil A, profile, B, porosity, C, structure, D, texture, and the answer is D, texture. The relative proportion of sand, silt, and clay in a given sample of soil is soil texture. Number 36, the first factor to be considered when deciding to cultivate a particular vegetable is A, cultural practices, B, selection of land, C, harvesting, D, method of propagation. And the answer is B, selection of land. The first factor to be considered when deciding to cultivate a particular vegetable is selection of land. Number 37. Which of the following factors should be considered when selecting a site for vegetable crop production? I, nearness to the market. I, I, topography of the land. I, 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 nearness to the sea. And the possible answers are A, A. I and I, I only. B, I and I, I, I only. C, I, I and I, I, I only. D, I, I, I and I, I, I. And the answer is A, I and I, I only. Which of the following factors should be considered when selecting a site for vegetable crop production? The answer is nearness to the market and topography of the land. Number 38, which of the following activities are cultural practices in the cultivation of cabbage? I, pruning. I, I, weeding. I, 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 watering. And the possible answers are I, A, I and I, I only. B, I and I, I, I only. C, I, I and I, I, I only. D, I, I, I and I, I, I. And the answer is D. Number 39, an example of a vegetable crop is A, cocoa, B, cotton, C, potato, D, tomato. And the answer is D, tomato. An example of a vegetable crop is tomato. Number 40, the majority charge carriers in a P-type semiconductor are A, electrons, B, holes, C, neutrons, D, protons. And the answer is D, protons. The majority charge carriers in a P-type semiconductor are protons.